guys what's up it's jordan um today i'm going to be doing a story time video and i'm sorry i'm posting this so late um but anyway i'm posting a story time video and yeah let's just hop right into it so keep in mind that my mom owns a salon um she owned a salon at the time in her house at the time and so like and i had like an older sister so obviously there might be like like clips or like maybe even like tweezers or like some like little scissors like around at the time like maybe like on the floor but like i guess i would have thought that we were smart enough not to touch them so anyway here i am my mom's cleaning my older brother's room i'm out in the hallway and you know like those little clips for like the like they stick into light sockets so babies can't get in them and like stick their fingers in them yeah well that was out and i'm like three at the time two to three maybe like almost three and i find tweezers on the ground and since i'm little i think i'm like two since i'm little i decide to go over and i put the tweezers in the light socket and I just scream. I scream. Because like ah. the electricity went through my hand. And I have a little scar there. I don't know if you can really see it. It went through here. It was so close to my heart. I could have died. Um, And I came out here. And I have like out my side. Like on my hip thing. On my hip. And I have a little scar there. And it's white. And that's where the electricity went out of my body. And that way, like, in the summer, m my entire body, like, tans or gets red or burns or whatever. And just that one spot stays white. And when it gets wet, it's pure white. Like, mm -mm. <laughs> Like, this girl is Ethiopian. Mm. <laughs> like, in this lighting, it's, like, lighter than this. When really my entire body's the same color. This lighting hates me. Okay, anyway. So I scream. My mom runs out of my brother's room. Out of the hallway. She sees my hand. It's burnt black from here to like here. Yeah, here. And I'm like. Ah, 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 ah. I'm screaming my head off. Like, mm, mm, mm. My mom takes me downstairs. She puts my arm under freezing cold water a burnt hand under freezing cold water which like apparently like you would think like would help but it burned um she grabs a bowl my mom also had a did daycare at the time but luckily it was a weekend and she had no one um so she was like Buffy Billy and like She's like, Buffy, come down here. Put your sister in the car. And she got, like, a water, like, a bowl of water in there. And my sister took me out to the car. She ran in. She buckled me up. She put my hand in that water. She went in. My As my mom came out with the keys in her purse, she grabbed my little brother. And we're like, oh, my God, let's go. And she, we bolted to the hospital. We're like, uh-uh not happening and my dad he did tree work at the time now he works for the town but anyway he um he did tree work at the time so he had this like log truck i don't even think it was a log truck i think they were doing some tree work but he had like this giant thing it was like a giant dump truck or whatever I don't really know what it was. I think it was actually a log truck. I'm almost positive a log. It was a log truck. And what happened was, um, so we're on our way. My mom's like flying to the hospital. Oh my god, we're like a half an hour away. Um, like that's where we live. Like an hour, like a half an hour, like 45 minutes away from the hospital. Um, she called my dad. She's like, oh my god, Jordan burned her up. She put her in the lights. Oh my god, oh my god, you have to call us. We have to meet us there. Oh my god, oh my god. So we drive there and 
we drive to the ER. We get in, we, I get bolted in, um, I get, like, stimulators attached to me, like, right here, all over my back, on my, like, right here, mm -mm. I'm attached to this machine, I blacked out, I blacked out, I wake up to all these stimulators all over me, I wake up to band-aids all, on all five of my arms, I wake up to an IV in my arm, I wake up, it was in this arm though, um, I wake up to like so many people around me, I'm in a little kid's room and like the TV's on, watching like Clifford, <laughs> anyway, I'm like, oh, oh my god, my hand, my hand, oh, oh, oh my god, why is it, why is it black, oh my god, <laughs> what, um, so I wake up to that and then I'm in like that nightgown thing with like the open butt <laughs> and I like my godmom, she wasn't my godmom, godmom at the time, she like when I got baptized she's my godmom now but anyway um, she takes me down to get something because she actually works there, she did and she still does, um, she works there and she took me down to go and get a cupcake. <laughs> And here I am with my little nightie on. Let's go. Let's go. And I, she's bringing like this, like, you know, like, like the blood pressure and everything. She brings that with me because it was attached to my IV. Um. So anyway, yeah. And then, uh, like, my dad comes in, and he goes to like the main entrance. I went to Dartmouth Hitchcock medical center um he goes into like the main entrance if you have ever been there and um this guy's like you can't park there and my dad's like i don't care my daughter's in there i'm not fucking moving sorry excuse my french he's like i'm not moving no uh uh and the guy's like i'll have a toad and my dad's like you have fun getting that toad because it was like a log truck like <laughs> Um, they didn't tow it. <laughs> they didn't tow it. Anyway, so all I remember is, like, going to my older brother's, like, baseball games after that. And every, like, half an hour, I had to, like, I, like, put my hand in, like, water and, like, iced it. And for, like, a half an hour. And I took it off for, like, a half an hour. And it was just, like, this battle. So wherever we had to, wherever we went, we had to, like, bring ice packs and like a bowl of ice water and like bottles of water and stuff and um yeah um and luckily we live like i don't know if you've ever been to like proctor's um i'm not gonna tell you where i lived because i still live in that general area but there's a store called it's like the proctor's general store or whatever i lived like right there and a good family friend that's still our good family friend yeah she came down every day and she checked on me because she's a nurse and she worked on the fast squad so um, she came down and she helped me and everything and she had like the hospital's permission like to do like tests and like check my blood pressure and stuff um so all of that happened and finally I had, like bandages still on my fingers all the kids from my mom's daycare is like, what happened? Oh my god, what the f? Okay. <laughs> so anyway, that actually happened to me. That's not a lie. Um. Ah. Okay. Um. Yeah. I hope you guys liked that. I hope that was entertaining for you. Um. Like, comment, subscribe. Leave a comment down below. If that has ever happened to, happened to you, like a crazy thing has happened to you and then if a crazy thing has happened to you or you can comment like video ideas or something like that so yeah bye guys thank you